As Israel faces mounting pressure over the worsening humanitarian crisis in Gaza, even from its strongest ally, the US, a new checkpoint opens at the Karim Shalom crossing to accelerate the delivery of aid to Gazans. Before entering the strip, aid trucks are inspected by Israeli authorities, a process that has caused bottlenecks as trucks loop south from Rafa to be inspected at the Alawaj Nitzana crossing on Egypt's border with Israel. The use of Karim Shalom on the border between Egypt, Gaza and Israel should allow the processing of more trucks, including some from Jordan, for the first time since the war began. A delivery that aid organisations say is more and more pressing. The people of Gaza are running out of time and options. As they face bombardment, deprivation and disease in an ever, ever shrinking space. They are facing the darkest chapter of their history since 1948. And it has been a painful history. As thousands of displaced Gazans lack food, shelter and medicine, fighting rages in the south, causing panic among the vulnerable. Honestly, I don't know how I'll give birth. How will I comfort my little child? Even for my young children here with me, there's nothing, absolutely nothing. And I'm about to give birth as well. But there's nothing for this newborn. No essentials. The UN estimates 1.9 million displaced Gazans are receiving aid from around 100 trucks per day.